Let me say this in closing. Worry is a rat. I read a story of an aviator making a flight around the world. And he stopped every four hours at selected landing places. On one leg of his journey, two hours from his takeoff and two hours from his landing field, exactly halfway, he heard a noise in the cockpit of the plane that he recognized as the gnawing of a rat. Not knowing which delicate indicators were being sabotaged by the sharp teeth of the rat, the pilot began to worry. He remembered that a rat is a rodent. He's not made for the heights. He's made to live in the ground in a dark hole. So the pilot nosed his plane higher and higher and higher and higher and higher until the gnawing stopped. And two hours later, whenever he landed safely, the body of the dead rat fell out in the floor of his cockpit. Worry is a rat. It cannot live in the secret place of the Most High. It cannot breathe in the atmosphere of faith. It cannot live in the atmosphere of confidence and worship. If your life's course has been altered by stress and worry, today I challenge you, climb, climb, climb higher, higher into the presence of the living God Feel his peace. Feel his reassuring touch. Feel his arms around you. His love. Worry must die. And faith will live because God is love. And his worry and the worry cannot take your life. Give the Lord praise in the house of God.